Good evening and welcome to Christians Aren't She, a beginner's guide to meditation. My name is Ron, I'm the host of this show, and this is a channel that you don't need to subscribe to, you don't have to smash the like button, and I will not be asking you for any money, any donations. This is simply a good place to come and hang out, get a little devotional time, Give you something to meditate on and yeah just keep tabs on, uh, on what's going on in my life <laughs> so oh it's speaking of my life I've got a sore left knee tonight <laughs> I've been the, the driving truck driving I've been doing includes driving through the city of PA both ways uh, for to make a trip and that's getting quite hard on my clutch leg or clutch knee. So I have to rethink how how much help I'm going to be to the family friend there. But I'll take going to take a little break tomorrow. Yeah, yeah. Today was eating was an eating day. So I've. Uh, had a breakfast sandwich, a lunch sandwich, and uh, a little baked spaghetti for supper. And uh, apple crisp and ice cream for dessert. And tomorrow will be a fasting day. And those just seem to be getting easier and easier. Yeah, anyway... Uh, today's devotional is from 1 John chapter 4. Dear friends, let us continue to love one another, for love comes from God. Anyone who loves is a child of God and knows God, but anyone who does not love does not know God, for God is love. God showed how much he loved us by sending his one and only Son into the world so that we might have eternal life through him. This is real love. Not that we loved God, but that he loved us and sent his Son as a sacrifice to take away our sins. Dear friends, since God loved us that much, we surely ought to love each other. E love each other. No one has ever seen God but if we love each other, God lives in us, and his love is brought to full expression in us. Yeah. Amen? Amen. Uh, going on to our devotional reading book. Today's uh, reading is called Human Chess Chess is an ancient game of strategy. Each player begins with 16 pieces on the chessboard with the goal of cornering his opponent's king. It has taken different forms over the years. One form is human chess, which was introduced around AD 735 by Charles Martel. Duke of Australia. Martel would play the game on giant boards with real people as the pieces. Could we be playing a human game of chess sometimes? <sighs> we can easily become so driven by our goals that people become just one more pawn as we use to achieve those goals. The scriptures, however, call us to do to a different view of others. We are to see people as created in the image of God. They are objects of God's love and deserving of ours as well. The Apostle John wrote, Dear friends, let us love one another, for love comes from God. Everyone who loves has been born of God and knows God. Because God first loved us, we are to respond by loving him and the people he created in his image. Yeah. It's, 
it's uh, very easy to <laughs> hate. That's a uh, put it real bluntly. Uh, when people do things that upset us or that we feel slighted by. It's easy to feel hate. Love does not come naturally to us. God, love is God-inspired. So that's a good thing to uh, meditate on this evening. and See where your feelings are. See where your... successes are yeah and if you want to see a really great expression of love and a really great expression of hate I challenge you to watch Jordan Peterson's uh, podcast where he interviews the uh, Alexander boys and it's entitled Bleeding without a permit, and uh, yeah, that's uh, <laughs> I challenge you to watch that. <laughs> okay, uh, that's all I got for this evening. Hope you have a great night. God willing, we'll see you tomorrow. Good night. <laughs>